we plan on pursuing the critical care market first because there's a real need in the hospital setting for a medical device that will monitor blood sugar levels continuously. Um, there is no approved product for use in the hospital market right now in the way of a CGM or continuous glucose monitor. What ECHO has is a non-invasive continuous glucose monitoring device which will allow nurses to provide better care for patients whether they have diabetes or not in monitoring their glucose levels. The traditional model right now in diabetes is to prick your finger. Well, the same thing is done in the hospital as well. They prick a patient's finger who's very ill or they draw blood and send it down to the central lab for a glucose value. That doesn't give the patient nearly enough information, the nurse, the caregiver, nearly enough information to manage their glucose levels aggressively with continuous insulin infusion. So what we would propose with our continuous glucose monitor is the patient wear the device, it will give real-time feedback to the nurses, tracking and trending information for glucose levels so the nurse can have real-time data by which she can better manage the patient's glucose levels. The clinical data is clear. Better glucose control in critically ill patients leads to improved patient performance and better patient outcomes. They get out of the critical care units faster if their glucose is controlled better. It's a simple concept. The way to control glucose better is to have more information related to glucose so you can control it on a real time and um, um, a more accurate basis.